Mark Felix off to a nice start. He's going after it, no doubt. He certainly is. This is an overall test of body strength. Your lower body, your upper body have to work in concert. Felix is so strong. What I like about him is that there's always tension on the rope, and he uses those big, powerful legs, and then his back takes over at the end, literally taking him all the way to the ground. That increases and maximizes his overall distance, which is why he's doing well here. Got to have that ab strength, too. I mean, look at how that works. The middle section of the body, he <laughs> continues to fight this. It would be hard enough for me just to do the sit-up part, let alone pull cars that weigh an amazing 15,000 pounds. I'm telling you, Mark Felix at 52 has found the fountain of youth. I feel like we say it every year. He's been so strong so far this year. And is he going to be the first to complete the course? Almost there. Time limit, one minute and he does it. Mark Felix, impressive. Just barely does it, Brent, by the hair of his chinny-chin-chin, chin, two one-hundredths of a second. But what was so impressive is that he got it done losing momentum there at the end. Again, he's the first to complete the course. And as you said, he snuck in under that one-minute time limit. This has really been an event that has been a separator, but he's the leader now. Covering the 25 meters in 59.98 seconds. Again, look at that power with the legs, the arms, the extension of his back. That extensor chain really took over and takes a well-deserved break. Rongo Keen of Australia was up first. Such an interesting man in the comeback he's made. Sent to prison for a 2015 assault of a man. Said he was trying to stop an attack. Here he is out for redemption. Pulls it 9.48 meters. He's one of the happiest guys out here, and he was certainly pleased with that result. One of the great personalities in the sport of strongman. Aaron, up next was Martin Forsmark of Sweden. He's a police officer back home. Does a tremendous job here throughout his entire pool. Certainly not going to pull over those jeepneys for speeding, weighing the 15,000 pounds, but does just enough to be able to get 17.49 meters, an impressive mark. Next up from Poland was Shistov Radzikowski. And you see him fighting it, but the arms and legs really in perfect concert, he was able to have a nice rhythm. But momentum is key in this event, and once those vehicles start to slow down, it's really hard to keep going. He was able to get it 13.27 meters. Manila, the capital of the Philippines, its economic hub, its cultural center, and in the heart of the city lays its historic roots. Manila's historic walled city 